Hi, so this is Chris Combs, KickMyLife.com, and I'm here with Emile Giroux. And Emile is doing something really special. Uh, well, you know what? I can't even do it justice. The thing's pretty badass, and I'm going to let him tell you all about it. So, Emile, man, how you doing, brother? Good, good. How you doing, man? All right. Yeah, I'm having a blast. Uh, I really appreciate you coming down to the spot. Um, you know, I know that uh, you're always out on the uh, lookout for different strategies, and I'm glad we had a chance to kind of come together and talk about it. But, you know, right now at M2 Fitness Pros, after being in this business for, you know, the last few decades, uh, the strategy that uh, I seem to really have a good grasp on right now is something that we're doing with our girls uh, that came aboard, uh, you know, getting them involved in uh, a little bit more of an advanced strategy like the human billboard, but taking it to a whole new level. It's like, you know, so I know right away, so many. trainers are going to be, ah, I've heard the human billboard thing before, I've heard it a thousand different ways, I've done it, or I don't want to do it, or whatever. You know, regardless of, you know, people's opinion on that, that strategy worked for me and some other people I know, but that's nothing what this, this video is about. Uh, however, it's where you got the idea for it. I think you just basically took that idea and you made the human billboard strategy do a whole bunch of push-ups and workouts and eat right for a couple of years and you, you, you know, came out with uh, a, a pretty damn killer program. So. Exactly, exactly. You know, we just, we, we put that, that billboard thing on its ear. I think the process of getting the girls that we have that come into our schedule uh, in a two-fold understanding about what it is that we'd like to see them do to help us build our business, but in exchange, we also help them build their business. A lot of the girls are coming from a place where they don't really understand that their bodies are going to really help them make a great deal of uh, additional income and work opportunities uh, from just simple modeling to all the way up to movies and TV, uh, which, you know, is actresses and so on and so forth, and touring musicians. So. We took it to the next level where we brought the girls in, we really helped them take already a lot of the skill sets they had, but taught them basic business skills in exchange for them really helping us to promote our business. Um, you know, in a nutshell, a lot of the girls that have come aboard each are responsible for building about five to six thousand dollars per month of additional revenue per month. How per many, girls. Per month, per girl. And how many girls do you have? Right now, 17. 17 um, times, let's say 5,000, I'll go to the low end of what you gave me. So do the math there, uh, that's per month in additional revenue on top of what you're already doing. Exactly. Which is pretty damn good. Exactly. Uh, exactly. So it's, it becomes part of you know a process where people come in as a response to their uh, meeting the girls at some event. And we have basically 17, 18 different ways that we position our girls uh, via a lot of different events and things that come up so that uh, they're seen, they get a lot of exposure, and you know, they have a certain look that attracts a lot of attention. So we've been really able to you know, position ourselves really well, and it's, it's, it's making my business very strong. Me and I couldn't be happier. Um, I think it's gonna be really successful for a lot of people when they find out about how we really put all this together. And there's, you use this strategy as a way to, to you know, basically be the underdog and come up and just outshine everyone else in the area um, and in a lot of the industry, because you're also in the uh, the, the competitive uh, bodybuilding figure athlete, that kind of industry as well, um, which isn't really what this whole this whole process is about. However, that's the way you went out and did it. So, um, you know, you guys have a uh, are making a big wave in that industry as well exactly. from the girls. So it's benefiting you and the girls who you're going to meet some of them in, f in future videos. Um, how. Uh, how your training program is benefiting them, mm -hmm. and how they're benefiting you, mm -hmm. and how basically you're making, you know, what's, you know, come on, uh, the shite load of extra money exactly. uh, every month from these girls. And it's pretty easy for you to go get them, uh, but you are very strategic about it. You have, it's like 17, I think, different ways that um, you're using these, uh, you know, there's 17 of strategies right, to, right. Uh, to make this, uh, this work in your business. And what we're gonna do, is in some free videos coming up on the blog. We're going to break down a few of those different strategies, uh, you know, in, in complete so people can see it uh, yeah. in full and uh, and uh, help a lot of trainers if they want to do this because this is really powerful. You told me about it, and I have trainers coming in all the time for guest blog posts and video ideas, and and you know, a lot of stuff starts to sound similar. And well, yeah, we're teaching how to get you know clients from Google, but really stuff just changed a little bit or something. You came to me with something that is so different from from. Anything I've ever seen. It reminded me of human billboards, but like a hundred times cooler. Because human billboards kind of sounds like a pain in the ass and like not all that fun. Uh, it can be fun, but you know, it, it can be a lot of work. This is a lot more fun, what you're doing. And I've seen you in action with the girls and what's going on, man. And they love you. They're getting you all kinds of clients. People notice them, who they are. They have the ideal body that 
that your market, their market wants, um, and it is one of the most powerful, you know, client attraction strategies I've ever seen. And it's not only that; it does so much else for your business in terms of positioning and everything else. So we're going to go over that, you know, in uh, in upcoming videos, so uh, trainers can start to implement some of this stuff, man. It's really powerful. Well, I appreciate the good word, Chris, and uh, you know, uh, back at you too. You've been able to be instrumental in building a lot of the businesses out there for a lot of us. And part of how I got where I am is because of the strategies that I've picked up and learned. And it's a process of tweaking some original ideas that you hear from someone else uh, to build something like what we've created. You know, uh, I know I, you mentioned 17 strategies that we use. Um, did you want to hear? Want you know what? Something yeah, that we, might we, be good. We, we, you know what? Let's do it. All right, so, hey, this is Chris McCombs, kickbacklife.com. I'm here with Neil Giro, uh in Long Beach at M2 Fitness Pros, and we're up on the roof of his loft. He, uh, he has a studio and a conference room and a, uh, like a couple of studios up here, mm -hmm. and then we're up on the roof where you are with an awesome view over Long Beach, man, and, and you're just killing it with, uh, you know, with, with your femme fatale strategy with these different girls that you have that are, are, are literally pulling clients uh, in, into your business left and right and your tribe is growing and growing and growing. It's one of the most original things I've ever seen in the industry. And what uh, what I want to know now is, is you have 17 different strategies to make this work, okay? That you use and you're specific, the exactly. way you do it, okay? Exactly. Um, someone doesn't need to do all 17, you know it, but they should do a whole bunch of them probably, right? Yeah, it's a good idea. <laughs> okay. It's a real good idea. Give us, give us one of them. Okay. You know, a lot of them intertwine, but you know, one of the biggest things that I see is the client retention ability and helping to keep people aboard. So when we do this, um, it's part of our education of our customers and clients. So we have to change and persuade mindset. So sometimes when we have uh, one of our strategies is a seminar monthly. And when we do the seminar, we have a motivational speaker that actually spoke for Anthony Robbins. So he comes aboard and we instruct our current members or one of the girls to bring a friend or two with them. Could be boyfriend, could be girlfriends. They bring them into the event and we might have an event of about 30 people. Uh, you know, 15 of them will be our regular folks and 15 uh, new people. When we do the seminar and my motivational speaker comes up and he talks about influence and persuasion strategies about getting people to overcome their typical reasons, I don't have money, I'm not motivated, so on and so forth. By the end of that event, we have five to 10 people signing up that month every time that he does that. And so when you start thinking about five to 10 new people every month that are spending yeah. $500 a month, you know, times those different strategies that we're gonna talk about, yeah. that's a really good return. And he's doing it with our, you know, consent and we work together at helping to persuade these clients, but we're not, it's not like we're doing something underhanded. We're doing something to provide value to our customers, to help them see the benefit of getting in the best shape possible. And if the girls are the view that they see that really attracts them into our system, they may never make it to a stage or make it to a magazine cover, but at least they're getting an opportunity to do something higher, better, and more quality than they've ever seen in any gym anywhere at all. Can you give us the Cliff Notes version of how to implement that strategy? So a trainer um, watching this right now could actually go out and do this. Okay, you know, basically you have a lot of information that you're gonna be giving your clients every month, whether it be on cardio, on weight training, or just mindset training. So you wanna plan a seminar, it could be 30 minutes, you could ask a lot of your clients questions about things that they wanted to know in the past month okay. and then do a seminar on that subject matter every month. And while you're giving them the answers to those questions, all of the people that are attending the event hear those answers, but then they all get to chime in and talk about their personal experiences and then they start to share stories. Once they start to share the story that they've had while they're working with us, it builds that bond and that's what it's about. Once we start establishing these bonds with our customers and clients, they stay with us for years. And everybody knows about the client retention and the value over a lifetime with a client. It translates to hundreds of thousands of dollars over a lifetime.